Well, let's see what happens here. Echo GT225 hasn't been ran in well over a year. It looks like it was drained before it was put away, so that's encouraging. Put some uh, officially labeled chainsaw 50 to 1 in here. Brewed on the uh, 529 or 23, so not super fresh, but it should be good. Most of that. Uh, most of that oil has a stabilizer in it, which should be fine. Let's see what happens. I'll try not to make a mess here. Hopefully that's on screen. I don't normally fill my string trimmers in this fashion, but like, I'm not gonna go full tank. Cause I honestly don't know if this is gonna run because I picked this unit up used a year, two years, three years, I don't even know. But it used, it used, and it had idling issues. It would not idle correctly, therefore I got it for a great steal of a deal. And I just put fresh fuel in it and ran it a bunch and it, it worked. So this says cold start, run, got a priming ball bowl here. It's completely dry. Let's pump that a few times. Make sure that we, and there's no fuel in it yet. We're starting to get fuel in it now. We'll say that. We'll go cold start. I'll stop. We don't want that. I really don't remember the procedure on this thing, so I'm just gonna do like what uh, what everybody else does. I'm just gonna wing it. So let me uh, back this up a little tiny bit here. Maybe I can shoot this. I don't know if I hold. It, we'll try no throttle first. I really don't see any instructions. So let's just go for it. See what happens. No, let's hold the trigger. Okay. I think it needs fuel. Let's get a couple more pumps. One, two, three. Go back to cold start again. Run. cold fire after a year yeah no that's it seems to be a pretty good unit um the person i purchased this from just got out of the lawn care home lawn care completely they're like nope i'm hiring it all out so they sold this a blower and a, and a chainsaw in a package deal and you know this this head garbage it only holds pre-cut strings that you have to like slide in there and they grip i mean if you don't got much to do yeah that's probably the one for you but like this is like the, there's no bump. Like literally you cut them and you shove them in and then that's it. So I usually cut them a little longer and wind them up in there so I can readjust them, like pull them back out and shit. It's like, it's a bunch of messing around. I'm pretty sure this is the size that goes with it. Don't quote me on that. That was sitting next to it when I pulled it out of the uh, storage area. But yeah, I mean, definitely homeowner grade, but the important thing is, is that it, well, does it work? And this one seems to work. I'm not sure why it had problems idling when I got it, but I... I think the guys had old gas in it if I had to guess, but yeah. Echo GT225. There you go, kids. Stay safe.